Yo, 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 everybody. Generic B here, and welcome to a brand new series. This is Submerge. Submerge just came out uh, today, August 4th. Um, and this is actually, I got an early access copy to it um, because I am currently on my way to Gamescom. Um, but so I've been following this game for a couple months. Uh, the cool guy is at Uppercat Games, Uppercat, Uppercut Games, um, gave me access to it. And um, let me tell you straight up, I played it for about an hour or so, and then I had to delete my save game. Um, tell you right now, this game is different. It is a easygoing, relaxing exploration game. If you like exploring and trying to find like uh, little artifacts and like secrets and stuff like that, if you enjoy the old school like Tomb Raider games where you used to climb and, and jump on little ledges, this game is for you. So no combat that I could tell. Let's jump right into it. And it's got a really interesting way that it unfolds the story. No dialogue either for the most part. There's some like fake English, but it's really cool. Boom, boom. And then there was the boat. So you notice, we may not notice because the game just started, um, it doesn't really give you the story. It's like the city is flooded. You can check it all out. There's buildings are right in the middle of the ocean, it seems like. <laughs> kind of like flame in the flood. Um, but why? What happened? And who are these people on the boat? That's the cool thing about this game is as you progress, you'll unlock the story and you'll understand more and more about what's going on. But there ain't no words, baby. And it's all it's all done with pictures, kind of like primitive uh, hieroglyphics or, or even caveman drawings. So it's really interesting. Hey, so as we can see, there's a woman, a young woman, and a young boy. And bunk. They just being lazy. No, he's hurt. He got a nasty cut along the belly. And she's wearing burlap harem pants. <laughs> okay, so. Now, we go on our merry way, carrying the young boy. This is going to be our base here at this little clock tower thingy. And we're just going to put put the boy in a little spot. Blink. Here you go, my son. My brother. I do believe he's my brother. Little brother. We'll find out. That's a nasty gash on that belly. Aha, uh -huh. so the first little bit. Back in the day, there was a village in the water, and there was a family with two kids, and the mama and the daddy loved each other very much. See, so that's the first thing we know. Amazing, the story you could tell is just simple pictures. Do, do, do. Oh. Say, pal, you don't look so good. All right, so now we have this journal, and the journal is, see, what, what did you just say? Um, <laughs> so the journal has all of your pictures and stuff that you unlock as you progress. So the story seems that the story unlocks as you, as the days go by. Um, then the city stories, there's creatures and landmarks, those you unlock um, as you go around and explore. So that's what we shall do. I need something to stop Taku's bleeding. Okay. So this is where the exploration comes in. Whoa, look at that. If we can see it. Ah, yeah, see? So now we've witnessed that creature. And that way the creature has been, uh, has been unlocked in the thing. It's really nifty how it works. Okay, so we get in the boat. And there's not a whole bunch of like cutscene type stuff like this. This is just at the beginning. Uh 
Uh-huh, she's witness something up there. What could it be? And now we accelerate. I need to boat over and climb that building. So usually you'll see like a little thing looks like uh, some roses on the side and a little black dot will show up. hi -yo! And now the fun begins. The Leonis Hotel. Okay, so. It, climbing's super easy. Um, and we have a map. Now you'll notice here, this shows where we are. That little kind of red cube is the supply crate, right? Supplies. Um, and then the little diamond is a secret. So there's two secrets on this building as well. So we need to pay attention to that. All right, so in order to climb, you just go to where you want to climb, press up. It's super easy. Bloop. Just like a so. It reminds me so much of, of Tomb Raider. Man, I used to play Tomb Raider. Like it was going out of style as a kid. Woo, I loved it. Now, <clears throat> it, is, it is good to notice uh, it is good to note on the map how many um, how many secrets there are because then it it makes it to where you want to kind of look around a little bit more so like your first instinct would be just to hop right up there immediately um, but you may want to like you know kind of look see if there's nothing usually it's pretty obvious uh, when there's something secret because it'll do a little glowy thing and it's on a on a pedestal. Like, there's the first one. I already saw it glinting. So we'll go boop, boop, boop. And you don't really have to worry about falling or anything. There's no death, there's no combat that I can tell. So there's the first little secret. And so that goes in the city story. I can only imagine that that's some kind of like, maybe a hurricane or something like that. Um, no landmarks yet. Um, but if we go back to here, you'll see that one of those is is found now, and we have one left and the and the other thing. So we can keep on trucking. Can't go down there to do anything. Whoop. No, no, come back, young lady. Bum 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 bum. bum. Oh ho! Yes. So. You can see right down here, there's a wall. Oh, there you go. And there's the other secret. Awesome. I missed that thing the, the first time I played. So now that is done, and if we look at our journal, there was a hurricane, and then the sun. Maybe. Can I hop up on that? No, I cannot. Aha. And a bloop, a bloop. <laughs> nice little dance. Okay. And then we can continue on our merry way. So because we know that we've already gotten all of the secrets of this one, I kind of like that they at least give you that hint that there's a secret. It's kind of nice, and we are approaching the top. All right, and la la. Emergency ration. What do we have? And blunk. So a health pack, and then it'll go back. The days. The days seem to progress whenever you find an emergency ration. That's how it seems to be, anyway. So she's gonna stop the bleeding. Okay, look pretty good. All right, hurry up and heal up, kid. What's wrong with you? And then she's done her bit, so she she relaxes, has a little snooze, and then story. See, he was a fisherman, the father, and he used to stab the fish. And then the family would eat the fish. Ha uh ha. -huh. Wakey wakey. Eggs and bakey. Oh, eggs and bacon. That sounds so good. G 
you know it's hard to get American bacon in Europe? They don't have bacon like like uh, Americans have it. I found one place where they make their own. This, I need to find some more of those crates. Okay. So, oh, I just noticed something over there flipping around. This is going to be cool. If I go over here and grab that one. Boonk. So now we have a boost. And so with the left shift, um, if I can turn around here a little bit, um, I can hold left shift and I go a lot faster. So it's good for maneuvering and such and so forth. Um, let's truck down here. Because I know that there is one thing. So there's a big old billboard thingy. Uh huh. And that, the princess and the golem. So that is a landmark one. So we've got one of eight of the landmarks. And then we can use, oh yeah, look at these pelicans. Aha. You have to just look at them kind of long enough and that's how it'll work. Um, we now have a telescope, which we can use to like see if there's any points. Yeah, like right there. Okay, that's a good one. Anything else around? Not at the moment. Let's go check that guy out. Um, how we get out of that? T. I'm down for that. Let's go. And of course, you just gotta keep your eye out for little things. Like if there's a boat flipped over, you can uh, you can use that. Um, little animals. Okay, we've already got those birds, so we don't have to worry about that. Okay, there's... Where was that thing? Oh, it's right here. Okay, yeah, and that's where we, we hop up on it. Um, let's use our... What is that thing? Seemed like that would be something. Uh-huh. Location added. That's about it. All right, get out of this. Let's hop up on here. Oh, bunk, <laughs> bunk. All right, got a good. Well, let's look at our map first, so we can kind of see. Looks like there will be one secret here. And this is a big map. Like you can see all the way up here, the corners, and how small. Small we are right now. Wow, okay. We've like barely covered any of the map. It's so cool. Beautifully made. And once we get up on a high ground, this will be perfect for scouting out with the uh, with the telescope. Oh yeah, yeah, like you saw it. I love how they do the camera changes too. Makes it different. You see that? There's a couple of flashies up there. That'll be our next goal, I think, because I bet one of those is a... Can I use a... I can. Uh-huh. Cool, yeah, so we did. That is really neat how that works. Maybe there's something I can use up there. Yeah, I would say so, young lady. Anything? Okay, let's wait till we get all the way to the top. Maybe a little easier. Why does this music remind me of Sweeney Todd? Right? And he loved her. <laughs> yes, my friends. <laughs> we shall have our revenge. <laughs> Such a good movie. I'm usually not big on musicals, but I really like Sweeney Todd. Okay, the bird's eye. Uh, so is this a landmark too? It is, cool. So we got a second landmark. Yeah, like I said, this is just like 
super easy going. I can totally picture this just being a game that you put put on the big screen, which which I do believe it is going to be uh, available on. Oh, here we go. Bloink. Um, I believe it's going to be available on consoles as well. I think I think I saw that they were applying. Yep, maybe something you can use up there. Yeah. Um, something that they were going to uh, they were applying for console. Uh, whatever they call it, a license, I guess is what they call it. Okay, looking around, we already got those guys. Anything else around here, pals? Okay, so far so good. But uh, yeah, I can picture like, you know, you're just playing it on the big TV with your controller, because this thing does have controller support as well. Um, actually, it would be really easy to play on a controller, because there's not a lot to it as far as, you know, control-wise. Okay, I think I see something. I think I see something right there. Okay, another potential one. Awesome. And, okay, there's that one that we saw. Oh, hello. Ooh -hoo. Oh, that's, that is actually our own base. So there's a little something up on top of that. It's good to know. Oh, hello. A little, a little trick. This is a good one to to use as a scouting. There's something right... No? No, it's just water. Water reflections. Okay. Let's get out. So, now if we see City Story... Don't know much about the story yet. We have two creatures and two landmarks. Alright. So, we gotta go back from whence we came. And then I say let's go... So that one building that was back there that had, uh, oh, this is it, right? Yeah. And whee! <laughs> That's so cool. I'm gonna go to that one so we can get a crate and see what's in it. And as you can tell, uh, from the very top, up in the little compass thingy, um, once you've discovered a place, you can, uh, it'll show up on your little compass so you know, like, kind of what direction to head to. Yes, and then we just go right. Oh, aha. Uh -huh. The obdurate creature. Obdurate? Obdurate? I've never heard of that word. Okay, got another landmark. Roger that. Oh, what was that below us? Did you see? Ah. Yeah, little fish, little flying fish. Ha! Oh, hey. Ooh, and a big stingray. Oh, and there's a boat thing. Definitely got to get the boat thing. So from what I've seen, most of these upgrades to the boat are just um, additional speed boost. All right, let's get out. Oh yeah, this could be a good one. Kitse Municipal. Kitis. Kitties. I love kitties. Okay, um, then we'll look at the map. Here's where we are. Oh man, there's like four, four little secrets to find. So we'll definitely have to keep our eyeballs open on this for alternative paths. So for instance, like we could go up that way. Whoa, did you see that guy? You see that thing? Okay, we gotta go check that out. Um, no, can't, can't do that from there though. I wonder what that is even for. Oh, I see, you see him? You see him right there? There's like some kind of creature. We gotta go check him out. Oh yeah, we can keep going to the top, but I wanna go down here. Don't you run, dude. Alright, and then you'll notice, like, that one we can't walk on. 
but we can do that. I see you, I see you. You better not run from me. Where did he go? Is he in there? Oh, we can't go there. Dang it. I was hoping we could get, uh, get a creature unlock off of that. Okay, four out of 60. Okay, we could climb that. Yeah, let's do that. Let's climb this bad boy. Oh, this goes all the way to the top. Or at least kind of looks like it goes all the way to the top. We can use this. Okay, there's one right there. As we're, Oh, yeah. Dude, you see him? I'm looking right at you. There. Okay, cool. Unlock that dude. Oh, hey, where do we go now? Hey! Oh, there we are. Okay. Oh, and then he dropped down. That little sneaky guy. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Oh, th wait. Is this... Is this from where... From whence we came? No, no. Different... Different spot? Different spot. Okay. Right? Or is it the same spot? No, no, it's different. Okay. Oh yeah, they, yeah, we were right down there. All right, got it. So now we can crawl up on that. Do a little hop, hop de hop. And then, so we still have. We've only got one. I think we have three more secrets. There's, there's a secret there. I see two secrets. So now we just have to figure out a way to get to that third one. Oh, we can't... That one's hidden. Oh, things are not as easy as it seems, huh? Oh yeah, look, there's that guy. But there's no combat, so it's so crazy. Oh, he just jumped off. I seen you. So maybe, oh come on, get on that, aha, we can climb up here, this'll, yeah, yeah, and then we can hop down, and this should be where we can get, where is it, hi-ha, okay, and then, Back up. And down. And I th Oh, wait, no, no, go down. Go down, girl. Get down, girl. Down, girl, go ahead, get down. Yeah. So if there's that way, we can hop around. And then once we get up there, I want to check the map and just make sure that there's only one more secret here. Map? Uh, where am I? Yes, just one more secret it looks like. All right, uh, map again. Now, if I were a dude, ah, yes, here we go. So we could grab this one, but then that'll bring us back immediately and we don't want to do that. So instead, we're going to hop around here really quick. And yeah, yeah. Get it, girl. Whee! Dude, can you imagine the tetanus shots you would need doing that? Okay. So now that's all of that. Let's go back up. Take a drink. And we'll check out the storyline after we grab this one and come back. A loop and a boop. What was that noise? Oh, it must be the uh, the beep of the medical supplies. 
Kind of like a little beacon. And ha ha. Okay, let's see what we got. Because every one has different stuff. So now we got a lighter. Right on. So we can put a little flame up in our place and stay warm. Oh, look, there's that dude. See, what part is, does he play in this story? We don't know yet, but we'll find out. Hello, my boy, my brother. He is not feeling good. Okay, little sleepers. And we find out more of the story. And then the mama, she went a fishing. And there was a storm. And then she drowned. Because she wasn't a good fisherman. Shame, shame. What do you need now, kid? Dang. Cry, baby. What do I gotta do? I need something for ta taco to drink. All right. And then, so if we look at the story, yeah. So we know all about this now. Mom went fishing. When dad fishes, food gets put on the table. Mom goes fishing, she drowns. That's the story. Um, not enough here to really understand what's going on. Looks like there's maybe some big waves came in and everybody's like, nah. That's, that seems like what's going on. And then creatures, we have... Wow! We have five of the creatures already. And then landmarks, we have three of that. Sweet! Alright, well that's going to do it for me for the first episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to... Since I am at Gamescom, um, I'm going to go ahead and do a series on this for at least as long as, as I'll be at Gamescom. Uh, that way you guys can enjoy it. If it's not for you... Sorry, but definitely if you enjoy like nice laid-back chill relaxing type of games Feel free to watch throw a like on the video or get the game yourself on Steam or on a console All right, that's gonna do it for me. Hope you enjoyed and until next time take care brush your hair I'll see you when I see you purse